Oh, we're short of fabrication in Tuscaloosa all the time. I'm going to tell you a cooker I just completed. Uh, uh, this is for Mike Festa. He's coming from South Carolina. Should be here in about 10 minutes. But uh, I'm just going to show you this is a 24 by 50 cooker right here. This cooker has a 3 8 thick cook chamber, which on all our 24 builds, that's what we're doing. So ask your builders, he's doing that for you. We do it at no cost. The upgrade on this, this is a 3 8 thick firebox right here. So you've got a 3 8 thick cook chamber, a 3 8 thick firebox. Basket slides in and out locked right here. Y'all compare this to other people that are building 48 model cookers and ask them about their custom stuff, what they're doing. And uh, I, got a, I got him a uh, ash rake and a fire poker right here. Got some utensil, utensil hooks right here on the side of this thing. Uh, this shelf right here, you lift it up, it folds down. Thing about a fold down shelf, you do not get, uh, on a fold down shelf, you don't get as wide a shelf because it'll hit the tires right there. These grapes right here, the bottom, top, bottom and top grapes are 21 deep and 41 long. And this is a 48, uh, 48 inch cook chamber right here. Slide out, both of them slide out and lock. You can imagine, I'm just saying two, four, six, you, you get 12, 14 butts on there, you know, no, no doubt, easy, 12 at least, 12 big butts. Probably more like 14 if you wanted to. But again, uh, it's just one of our beds. Got an area right up under the cooker where you can uh, just lay stuff. I've got a little hook right here for when he drains his grease. I told Mike, as close as this is, probably just put a restaurant pan up on here and just drain it right into the restaurant pan right here. This cooker here, this cooker here has eight inch trailer tires on the back right here, and it's got swivel uh, pneumatics up on the front that are, uh, uh, they're, they're no flat pneumatics. They don't have air in them and everything. Ross, are you watching me now? Oh, Ross is feminine me right there. He's he good welding and, and fitting and all. I don't know about feminine. But again, uh, this cooker <coughs> here has gaskets around the doors. Again, is your builder doing that? Going to seal off really tight. It, it, it seal off tight without the gas. But uh, this cooker here, it's going to seal off tight. And this gaskets are new, so it's going to take a little bit for them to compress and make it easy to put on there. Has two probe inserts right here, you know, for the wireless probe. Again, his hooks to put his stuff on. So this is just a, you know, a, a jam up build right here. I did it, and I'm proud of it. Uh, it's got the traditional door. It's got the traditional door on it, and everything. So, again, when you, you know, when you ask your builders what all they're offering on the 48 model, compare that 48 to some other people's 48, and, I, and mine's gonna come in, you know, uh, less expensive too. I don't mind telling you, this bill right here is right, on, right at the $2,000 range. $1,900 something dollars is what it is. But uh, anyway, this is Paul with Shirley Fabrication in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. We appreciate everybody's business. Uh, you can call Tyler at 205-799-0251 or Tyler at ShirleyFabrication.com or Paul at ShirleyFabrication.com. And my number is 205-310-9160. Tyler, what's your bank log now? Huh, Tyler ain't there. It's about six months. Mine's not quite, mine's not as long. Mine may be three. But anyway, uh, thank y'all for y'all's business. Give us a call and we out here.